Looks like he's tending to his wounds. Nope, never mind. That's that's not tending to his wounds. Hello everybody, welcome to today's video. So I personally have not played Mass Effect and I thought let's do a let's play series, so I feel like this would be a good starting point. So welcome to Alliance let's Military get into Database. It. Classified information requested. Ooh, let's connect. Establishing secure connection. Establishing secure connection. Secure connection confirmed. Oof. Alrighty. Confirm your ID as CDR John Shepard Alliance Marine. Let's do a manual one. Let's do a custom Please mail. Please log in to access your profile. First name. Um, Nocturne. Oh, Nocturnal Shepard. Screw it, that works for me. Let's do this. Decrypting. Verifying username. Verifying user data. Warning. Data corruption detected. Data corruption? Automatic reconstruction failed. Data corruption? What the fuck? Please reconstruct profile. Confirm pre-service history. Alright, well, let's see. Both partners with the Alliance military. Your child was spent in ship stations transferred from position. Transfer from posting to posting, never staying in one location for more than a few years. Following your parents' footsteps, you enlisted at the age of 18. You were born and raised in Mindor, a small border colony of Atikan Transverse. When you were 16, slavers raided Mindor, slaughtering your family and friends. You were saved by passing Alliance patrol. You and you enlisted in the military a few years later. You were an orphan raised on the streets of the great megatropolis covering Earth. You escaped the life of pity, crime, and underworld ganging, enlisting in the Alliance military. Ah, uh, let's do Earthborn. Confirm psychological profile. Psychological. Soul survivor. During your service, the mission went horribly wrong, trapped extreme survival situation. You were to overcome the physical torments of psychological stress. Psychological. Early in the military career, you found yourself facing overwhelming enemy force. You risked your own life to save your fellow soldiers and defeat the despite the impossible odds. Your bravery and heroism have earned you medals of recognition from the Alliance fleet. Pretty interesting. What's the ruthless? Throughout your military career, you held fast to one basic rule, to get the job done. You've been called cold, calculating, and brutal. Your reputation for ruthless efficiency makes your fellow soldiers weary of you, but when failure is not an option, the military always goes to you first. I like Soul Survivor, but I think I'm going with the ruthless one. Confirm I like military it. specialization. Alrighty, Vanguard, Sentinel. Infiltrator, Adept, Engineer, Soldier. Alright, I... Uh, infiltrator. Vanguard's a biomedic warrior. They combine biotics and weapons to take down opponents and are especially deadly at short range. Um, they use pistols and shotguns and can specialize in medium armor. Sentinels combine biotic and tech abilities. Typically, they use biotic abilities and advanced healing skills to defend allies. Though they can also disrupt opponents with biotic tech attacks, they're more efficient in tech and biotics and other classes, but at the expense of combat, sentinels can only use light armor and receive no advanced weapon training. Then infiltrator. Infiltrators are combined the abilities of specialized in killing and disabling enemies at long range. Infiltrators are trained to use Omni tools focused on decryption and offensive abilities rather than healing. They can use pistols and snipers. Decryption of offensive abilities rather than healing. They can use pistols and snipers and medium armor. Adept. I think I want to be an infiltrator. Confirm facial identification. Confirm appearance, change appearance. Let's change it. Cycle preset. Wait. Let us start with this guy. Okay. Facial construction, what can we do? Um Jesus. Now let's go with more of a tone. Uh a little bit dark. Complexion. No, we'll do no complexion. No scars. We don't want any of that stuff. We just started. We're a newbie. Neck thickness. Ooh, macho man. Yeah, no. We're going with small. I don't want it too big, but 
Let's go with like maybe right here. Eyes. I don't like how it's like I want more of an open there. About right there maybe. Wah wah. <laughs> when you see a hot girl. <laughs> Whoa. Do you see that? She's so stunning. Alright, let's do right about here. Bro. Just always pissed off. Just fuck you guys. Resting bitch face. Um, I can go get behind this. Yeah, let's do hair and then we'll be good. Beard? Yes, we need a beard. We are a man, so all men need beard. A little five o'clock shadow? Yeah, yeah, we'll do that. Sorry for a second, I thought I saw a mullet. Yeah, I like this one. Got a little style to it. Blonde, red, that would, we're going with black. All right. Profile reconstruction complete. Alrighty. Nocturnal Shepherd, I am an earthborn ruthless infiltrator. Identification con All right, let's do this. Let's get right into it. So that way we can determine. <clears throat> well, what about do. Shepherd? Earthborn, but no record of his family. He doesn't have one. He was raised on the streets, learned to look out for himself. He got most of his unit killed on Torfin. He no, gets the job done. Yes, I do. No matter what the cost. Is that the kind of person we want protecting the galaxy? Of course. That's the only kind of person who can protect the galaxy. I'll make the call. Do it. I'm the only one that can save this galaxy. In the year 2448, explorers of the Mars discovered the remains of an ancient spacefaring civilization in the decades that followed these mysterious artifacts revealed startling new technologies enabling travel to furthest stars the bias for the incredible technology was a force that controlled the very fabric fuck i couldn't read it quick enough so pretty much we found technology and it made us advance i like that pretty good so the arcturus prime relays in range Initiating a transmission sequence. All right. Commander. Let's do this. Let's go get that bread. We are connected. Calculating transit mass and destination. Okay. The relay is hot. Acquiring approach vector. All stations secure for transit. What are we approaching to? SR1 Board is green. Approach run has begun. All right, let's get in. Let's do this. What is that thing? Oh, badass. So did we die or... Check. No. Navigation. Check. That'd be Internal a way to end the game. Engaged. All systems online. Drift. Just under 1500k. Alright. 1500 is good. Your captain will be pleased. Your captain? I am I the captain. Nihilus gave you a compliment. So you hate him. Hmm. <laughs> You remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having them on board. Call me paranoid. You're, You're paranoid. fucking paranoid. The council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. Yeah. Yeah, that is the official story. But only an idiot believes the official story. You always expect the worst. You are Our overreacting. Bad are an occupational hazard. But we don't go anywhere unless there's a good reason, so... What are we doing here? Joker! Status report. Just cleared the mass relay, Captain. Stealth systems engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Find a comm buoy and link us into the network. I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass before we reach each Guy's a little bitch. Aye, aye, Captain. Not the Better Captain. brace yourself, sir. I think Nihilus is headed your way. He's already here, Lieutenant. Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the calm room for a debriefing. All right. You get that, Commander? I'm on my way. 
Is it me or does the captain always sound a little pissed off? Only when he's talking to you, Joker. Because Joker's fucking retarded. He's a little edgy bitch. Press O to use the codex to talk to an ally. Approach and press E. To access detailed tutorials in the secondary tab, plus the sign in next to the player tutorials. Okay, basic controls. Combat. Q to draw and holster your weapon. Left click or left left click or press left mouse button to fire your weapon. Space, character advancement, blah 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 blah. Okay. Primary. The three most political important species in the galaxy. Roughly 1200 years ago, the Turians were invited to join the Citadel Council to fulfill mm. the role of galactic peacekeepers. Okay. The Turians have the largest fleet in Citadel space, and they make up the single largest portion of the Council's military forces. As their territory and influence has spread, the Turians have come to rely on the Solarians for military intelligence and the Asari for diplomacy. Okay. The Systems Alliance is an independent supranational. Okay, well, navigate press. You gotta give yourself an ulcer. You're, yourself. Oh, it's an air thing. I grew up on Eden Prime, Doc. It's not the kind of place. Alright, well, mission. looks like on the map I gotta go over here, so. That's crazy. The captain's in charge here. He won't take orders from a spectre. Let's go over here. Hello, sir. Commander Shepard. I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. What about? Yeah. I'm interested in this world we're going to. Eden Prime. I've heard it's quite beautiful. I've never been there. But you know of it. It's become something of a symbol for your people, hasn't it? Has it? Proof that humanity can not only establish colonies across the galaxy, but also protect them. But how safe is it, really? Do you know something? Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. Okay. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. Is the Alliance truly ready for this? I think it's about time we told the Commander what's really going on. This mission yeah, is far let me know. more than a simple shakedown run. Is someone gonna fill me in, Captain? We're making a covert pickup on Eden Prime. Okay. That's why we needed the stealth systems operational. There must be a reason you didn't tell me about this, sir. Yeah. This comes down from the top, Commander. Information strictly on a need-to-know basis. All right. A research team on Eden Prime unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. Okay. It was Prothean. What the hell's Prothean? I thought the Protheans vanished 50,000 years ago. Their legacy still remains. The mass relays, the Citadel, our ship drives. It's all based on Prothean technology. This is big okay. ship. The last time humanity made a discovery like this, it jumped our technology forward 200 years. But Eden Prime doesn't have the facilities to handle something like this. We need to bring the beacon back to the Citadel for proper study. Obviously proper this goes study. beyond mere human interests, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. Why did you tell- why did we tell the Council? I'm glad you- glad you're here to help. You sound worried. We don't need your help here. Uh, yeah. It never hurts to have a few extra hands on board. The beacon's not the only reason I'm here, Shepard. Okay. Nihilus wants to see you in action, Commander. He's here to evaluate you. Guess that explains why I bump into him every time I turn around. <laughs> the Alliance has been pushing for this for a long time. Humanity wants a larger role in shaping interstellar policy. We want more say with the Citadel Council. Okay. The Spectres represent the Council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, it shows how far the Alliance has come. And you I was wanna... impressed when I studied the reports from Torfin. A grim business, but you got the job done. That's why I put your name forward as a candidate for the Spectres. You support this, Captain? You put my name forward? Why would a Turian want a human in the Spectres? Not all Turians resent humanity. Some of us see the potential of your species. We see what you have to offer to the rest of the galaxy, and to the Spectres. Okay. We are an elite group. It's rare to find an individual with the skills we seek. 
I don't care that you're human, Shepard. I only care that you can do the job. Okay, what's Just next tell me step? what I have to do. I need to see your skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime will be the first of several missions together. You'll be in charge of the ground team. Secure the beacon and get it onto the ship ASAP. Nihilus will accompany you to observe the mission. Oh yeah, we're always going to be on the ground. Okay. You'll be in charge of the ground team, secure the beacon and get it to the ship ASAP. Nihilus will be encountering. Okay, let's investigate. Um, beacon. Why is this beacon so important? All advanced galactic civilization is based on Prothean technology. Even yours. If we hadn't discovered those Prothean ruins buried on Mars, we'd still be stuck on Earth. That was just a small right. data cache. Who knows what we can learn from this beacon? What if it's a weapons archive? We can't let it fall into the wrong hands. Like who? The Attican Traverse isn't the most stable sector of Citadel space. There are plenty of raiders and criminal groups active in the region. Okay. They might figure a Prothean beacon is worth the risk of attacking an Alliance ship. Plus, Eden Prime is right on the border of the Terminus systems. The Attican Traverse is under Citadel protection. If the Terminus systems attack, it's an act of war. Technically, yes. But some of the species in the Terminus might be willing to start a war over this. The last thing the Council wants huh. is to get dragged into a major conflict with the Terminus systems. We have to keep this low key. All right, let's go. Just give the word, Captain. We should Pretty much we gotta get this to Captain, stop a war. we got a problem. What's wrong, Joker? Transmission from Eden Prime, sir. You better see this. Bring it up on screen. Okay. Oh, let me guess. They're already attacking. We are under attack, taking heavy casualties. I repeat, heavy casualties. We can't get evac. They came out of nowhere. We need. Well, yep, looks Everything like we're under attack there. That. No calm traffic at all. Just goes dead. There's nothing. Reverse and hold the 38.5. Okay. Status report. 17 minutes out, Captain. No other Alliance ships in the area. Take us in, Joker. Fast and quiet. This mission just got a lot more complicated. A well, small yeah. strike team can move quickly without drawing attention. It's our best chance to secure the beacon. Grab your gear and meet us in the cargo hold. All right, so it looks like we're going to go into a hot Tell zone. Tell and Jenkins to suit up, Commander. You're going in. Fine. I don't know why you don't do it, but... Fuck it. Engaging I'll let him know. Somebody was doing some serious digging here, Captain. Of course, we had to find the room. Your team's the muscle in this operation, Commander. Go in heavy and head straight for the dig site. What about survivors, Captain? Helping survivors is a secondary objective. The beacon's your top priority. Okay. Approaching drop point one. Beacon one, Hi. survivors two. You with us? I move faster on my own. Nihilus will scout out ahead. He'll feed you status reports throughout the mission. Otherwise, I want radio silence. We've got his back, Captain. The mission's yours now, Shepard. Good luck! He's like a badass mercenary or something. We are approaching drop point two. Let's go. Let's drop. Alright, saving. Keaton Elenko and Richard J. K. So. This place got hit hard, Commander. Hostiles are everywhere. Keep your car up. Okay. Cue to draw your weapon. Left mouse to fire your weapon. Okay. Damn. All right. Press Q to hold so your weapon. Okay. Well, I believe this is the way to go. Or at least I hope so. Toxic seals reduced to Omni Gel. We'll take them. 
Oh, can't go that way. Where else can we go then? Oh, I see. I'm supposed to go this way. Again, really new to this game, so all this is like brand new. I have no idea what's going on, even though I think it's a couple year old game. I have no idea what to expect. Wait. Oopsie, going the wrong way. We need to go over here and up there. Okay. Do do do. Do 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 do. This is the way to go, I see. I don't know, sir. Hmm, just more of those floating things. Yep, just got a guy killed. You have gained a level. When you gain a level, press U to open your squad screen and improve your squad's abilities. Click on a talent point to improve your ability. Mouse over the talent for more information. Select each squad member and spend their points. I think on this guy... Wait, how many points do I have? Right here, six. Charm. Opens the charm options of conversation, decreases the cost of items in store. Intimidate. Rely on stealth and reconnaissance infiltrate. Prefer to take their enemies out of the distance. Decryption. Increases the amount of Omni Gel recovered. No idea what Omni Gel is. Increases the strength of your shields. I think I'm going to put one here. One here and one here. Actually, put another one here. Increase the pistol to. There you go. Undo. Auto. What do you recommend? Increase pistol damage and accuracy reduces the chance of overheating. Okay. So you don't recommend. It. Okay. I guess we'll go with that. Pistol and electronics. Oh, I got him killed. Wow. Sometimes Marines die. The rest of us just have to carry on. We still have to find that beacon. Yeah. Aye, aye, sir. Sorry. I sort of sent him out there and he got killed. That's the way war works. We must go and we must find the source of bullshit. Oh. oh shit. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. The fuck is this? Left control to crouch. To uncrouch. Hold on, how do I. I think this might be a little bit overkill right now. Alright. Better catch up with me on the dick site. Armor upgrade and weapon upgrade. We'll just take both of them. I'm just gonna record. Or I'm gonna collect most of the items. Just because I'm not Come sure on. which ones I need. But hold on. Where are you? Equip the sniper. Okay. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Just stay there. Got you. Got you. I wish I could see these enemies further, but I guess I'll just stick with the pistol. Wait. What the fuck did I just do? Okay, then. Oh! Run, Forrest, run! Boom! She got him. Oh, looks like he's tending to his wounds. Nope, never mind. That's that's not tending to his wounds. 
Holy shit. Yeah, I mean, if he was suffering, that helped, but I don't think he was suffering, so... Time to kill him. Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. You the one in charge here, sir? Uh, Are you wounded, Williams? A few scrapes and burns. Nothing serious. The others weren't so lucky. Okay. Oh, man. We were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. Where's the rest of your squad? We tried to double back to the beacon, but we walked into an ambush. Ooh, that's I don't think any good. of the others... I think I'm the only one left. Oh no. That's horrible. Um... This isn't your fault, Williams. You couldn't have done anything to save them. She couldn't. Yes, sir. We held our position as long as we could, until the Geth overwhelmed us. Geth. The Geth haven't been seen outside the Vale in nearly 200 years. Why are they here now? They must have come for the beacon. Of course. The dig site is close, just over that rise. It might still be there. We could use your help, Williams. Aye, aye, sir. It's time for payback. Yes. I like it. Move out. <clears throat> Take all. Pressing I opens the equipment screen, which allows you to switch and modify your weapons and armor. The other items used in the squad. Let's go to the equipment screen now. Fuck you, I didn't want to. Thanks for letting me have a choice. Okay. Equip the pistol I actually gave you by clicking on the pistol icon. Right here. Double click the weapon to equip it. And then click the ammo upgrade slot and install your ammo. The ammo upgrade slots is located above the damage bar in the equip item section. Every weapon has at least one weapon that can... Every weapon has at least one weapon. And one ammo upgrade slot. Sorry, that didn't make sense for me. Click the weapon icon to access the weapon upgrades and click weapon. Click the bullet icon to access the ammo upgrades. Weapon upgrades, ammo upgrades. Okay. Um... Shotgun, saw rifle, pistol. I wasn't given a pistol, I guess, even though you said you did. Alright. Pursue to go to the squad's green, spend talent points on new squad members. Okay. Click on the talent. Click on a talent and spend to improve the ability. Move the mouse over the talent. Overkill allows long burst of accurate assault rifle. Alright, well, we're gonna do an auto upgrade. <laughs> Run over here. Well, let's go. If it's at the far end, we gotta get there. Got a long ways to go. Rest in peace, sir. Run to the waypoint and cover behind to protect from enemies. Enter cover on the rock with your weapon. There. Move to the edge of the rock with the left mouse button to fire from cover. Okay. Press control or stand up when automatically crouched to take How do you see him? I fucking killed him. There's no way you could have seen him before I shot his ass. Oh shit. That's the enemy then. To uncrouch, control again. Boom! I think I missed that shot, but... I think all in all, we're good. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh yeah, level up! Okay. Come on, guys, let's get going. We gotta find this dig site. This is the dig site. Oh shit, never mind. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By oh. who? 
Our side or the Geth? Hard to say. Maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp. We make for the camp. It's just on the top of this ridge, up the ramps. All right, let's go. Change of plans, Shepard. There's a small spaceport up ahead. I want to check it out. I'll wait for you there. Okay, well, let's go. I don't think that does anything. Yeah, I keep thinking that's gonna like enable sprint or something. Looks I don't like think it's doing anything. No, what gives you that idea? Keep your guard up. Oh God, they're still alive. What did the Geth do to them? Is that converting them actually? Press R to throw a grenade, wait for time detonation, or press R again to detonate. Throw a grenade at the husk's feet now. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Whoa. No scoped, bitch. The health is low. Approach the squad member, proceed to brief on your current situation. Approach the squad member to hear a brief call. Okay. Now we know what those spikes are for. Turning our own dead against them. We thought this world was safe until the Geth showed up. How do I heal? Is it H? No? Z. You are walking, press Z to run. Okay. X, C. I know R. Okay, Q's for weapon. Y, U. Again, we'll just do an auto upgrade. Alright. The Ampening. Increases the explosion radius of your tech's proximity mind. Shut down enemies' tech and biotic abilities. Sounds like it could be useful. But. I need to heal. Click on the filter tab to switch between item types. Select an item for the list of models and click the equip button to wield it. Filter. Details. Omnicha. Cover item in the Omnicha. No. Shotgun. Yeah, let's equip that one. Oh, this is a... Okay. I see. I'm getting it a little bit. Alright. My armor. Selected. Let's equip this then. Because it's got better shit. Convert it into Omni Gel. And convert this one into Omni Gel. Convert this one into Omni Gel. Okay, now. Ashley. We got a good enough weapon, anyways. Shipper's got a better one, so we'll just scrap that one. Looks good. Now, what I need is equipment. Filter tab to switch between the item types. Select the item and the list of available models and then click the equip button to wield it. Click on the Omni Gel button to permanently convert. Okay. I'm still trying to find the filter tab. Oh, is that it? Equipment. I need to heal. Okay, well, let's go to controls then. Figure out what the healing is. First aid, F. Okay. Using a first aid, Medi-Gel. Medi-Gel can be used to acquire from defeated opponents. Okay. Good to know. Assault rifle. Take all. Omni gel. Oh, let's equip the assault rifle. You've equipped an untrained.
trained weapon which reduces the damage and accuracy. Press space to change the squad's weapon. This is cool. Orders the commander squad powers and look around. Previous key. All right, this is a little, little interesting. Easy decryption. Move the keys of WASD to advance the central core. Avoid security programs. Wait, hold on. Oh, I see. I think I got it. Okay. There we go. Okay. Now we should be able to get in. Humans. Thank the maker. Hurry. Close the door before they come back. Don't worry. We'll protect you. Thank you. I think we'll be okay now. It yeah. looks like everyone's gone. I know you'll be. Your yeah, Dr. because Ward, I killed them all. The one in charge of the excavation. Do you know what happened to the beacon? Do you? It was moved you to better. the spaceport this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to help pack up the camp. When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. They gave their lives to save us. No one is safe. So they died in honor. The age of humanity is ended. Soon, only ruin and corpses will remain. What's wrong with your assistant? Manuel has a brilliant <laughs> mind, but he's always been a bit unstable. Genius and madness are two sides of the same coin. Is it madness to see the future? To see the destruction rushing towards us? To understand there is no escape? No hope? No. He's hopeless. I am not mad. I'm the only sane one left. I gave him an extra dose of his meds after the attack. <laughs> Say goodnight, Manuel. You cannot silence the truth. My voice must be heard. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh shit! What did you do? That might have been a little extreme. <laughs> you can't just Whoops. go around whacking people in the head. Just a little bump on the head. Let him sleep it off. I suppose you're right. By the time he wakes up, the meds will have kicked in. <laughs> Whoops, my bad. Um. Williams, take us to the spaceport. Good luck, Commander. I'm sorry, sir. I did not mean to knock you the fuck out. I can make sure it's official. No. I don't feel like pressing my luck. <laughs> Whoops. My bad. <coughs> <coughs> Jesus. I'm sorry, sir. I had no intention on punching you. I thought when he said he could shut him up, he wasn't going to go up and just fucking punch him. I thought when he said he could, he was going to let the girl know, hey, I can shut him up, and she's going to go, oh, no, no, don't do it. I'm such a good girl. I don't want you to knock him out. He's a good guy. And then I just sit there and go, nah. I won't hit him. I just want to intimidate him. But instead, nope. I'm just going to fucking knock his ass out. Alright. Let's go to the spaceport. Come on, sir. Sarah. Nihilus. This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The Council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Don't worry. I've got it under control. Oh, a traitor. He's over the power to knock down oh, enemy is, shields. It's a ship. Oh, Look shit. Wow. Oh, 
Hold up, let me re refresh my weapon. Jesus. Oh, guys, you get him. Got him, got him? Okay. I feel like that's doing nothing. This, like, sucks at aiming and everything. Okay, I wanted... Yeah, I wanted this in the first place. Okay. Uh-oh. Please don't be dead. A Turian? You know him? He's a Spectre. He was with us on the normal. Something's moving over behind those crates. Wait! Don't! Don't shoot! I'm one of you! I'm human! Sneaking up on us like that nearly got you killed. I am sorry. I was hiding from those creatures. Okay. My name's Powell. I saw what happened to that Turian. The other one shot him. You're saying Nihilus was murdered by a Turian? The other one got here first. He was waiting when your friend Traitor. He, he called him Saren. I, I think they knew each other. Your friend seemed to relax. He let his guard down. And Saren killed him. Shot him right in the back. I, I'm just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. Where'd Saren go after he killed Nihilus? He jumped on the cargo train and headed over to the other platform. Probably going after the beacon. I knew that beacon was trouble. Mm. Everything's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. Everyone. If I had been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. How come you're the only one who survived? Why didn't anyone else try to hide behind the crates? They never had a chance. I was already oh. behind the crates when the attack started. You lucky son of a bitch. Wait a minute. You were hiding behind the crates before the attack? I... Sometimes I need a nap to get the <laughs> shift. I sneak off behind the crates to grab 40 winks where the supervisor can't find me. You survived because you're lazy? If you hadn't snuck off for that nap, you'd probably be dead just like all the others. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Look at that. Slacking actually saved his life. I don't really want to think about it. Slacker. We need to find that beacon before it's too late. Take the cargo train. That's where the other Turian went. Okay. I, I, I can't stay here. I need to get away from all this. You sure? You don't want to take another nap or anything? I mean... Might save your life again. Shit. Okay. Oh look, sprinting actually works now. Shit, shit, shit. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up. Don't mind me. No! Right arrow. <laughs> Maybe I should heal before going out there. Shit. Use up arrow to command your squad to move ahead. Oh. Well, I'm gonna equip this guy. Does that have more accuracy with him? Okay, now. Go. Let's do this again. I don't even know if I'm hitting him. Oh, what the hell? Throw on get destroyer. Okay, so I gotta gotta go like this, son.
Ow. Order Caden to use a biotic to throw on the Okay, um... Click... Right click on and rotate the camera. Get the story, click on Caden's throw power, release the spacebar. Okay, what? I did it. Order Caden, use a biotic throw on the Get Destroyer. Overload, throw, sabotage. Oh, okay, I guess he finally decided to do it. Okay, hold up, I wanna grab this guy. So you, I'm gonna order Caden, throw. Destination blocked. Boom! Got he. Okay. And Hold up guys, just wait a sec, I gotta heal. Just give me a sec. Okay, got you. Okay. Medi gel. Oh, I see. My sprint bar's got to regenerate. Okay. Okay, well, if I don't have a trained for it, I better equip the pistol where I am trained for it. I love accuracy, but... Set the charges. Destroy the entire colony. Leave no evidence that we were here. Why, you don't want to be classified as a traitor? You already are. What the fuck? Hey guys, just uh, so you know, the dream team. Demolition charges. The Geth must have planted them. Hurry, of course they did. Who else would have? Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Where am I getting shot from? Oh. Excuse me, coming through, don't mind me. Alrighty. Got you guys. Where are you guys getting shot from? You shooting at me, motherfucker? Boom. Hold on, guys. I gotta let my gun stop overheating. Give me a sec. You know how it is. What the fuck? Crap.
to uncrowd for this control again. I already know. <coughs> okay. Boom! One shot, one kill. Better heal up. Take all. Oh, look, another bomb. Let's disarm this motherfucker. Booyah! How about, how about, oh, I'm curious. Let's get the bastards. I like your mindset. I think I'm going to start doing the space because it seems a lot quicker than trying to navigate the mouse wheel. Where oh where would the last bum be? Where oh where can it be? Is it here? Or is it there? Oh where oh where can it be? Is it over here? Nope. We move. Of course we should move. I shouldn't be talking to you while I'm trying to find bombs. Do, do. Did I pass it? Oh, nope. There it is. Shit. I got it. Hold up. I got two minutes to disarm this one bomb. I got it. Just give me a break. Got it. There we go. And presto, lives were saved. All barms disarmed. Good job. Now, we must continue with the mission. Which I believe is going to lead us this way. Alrighty guys, let's go do this. Hello everybody, we're here to fuck shit up. Excuse me, sir. Oh shit, hi. Nope. Oh shit, nope, nope, run! I don't know how to reload my guns if I'm supposed to. I think it does automatically. What is this? Prothean beacon. Let's investigate. Alright. Normandy, the beacon is secure. This is amazing. Actual working Prothean technology. Unbelievable. It wasn't doing anything like that when they dug it up. Of course it wasn't. Something must have activated it. Roger, Normandy. Standing by. <laughs> what are you doing, girl? Ooh, yeah. You just got saved. No, don't touch it. It's too dangerous. Whoa. So my guy just got raped. What the hell just happened? The artifact did something to my guy, and now my guy's unconscious. And I bet you more than anything, he's gonna get in trouble by the council because it is now destroyed. We identified the ship that touched down on Eden Prime, the Normandy, a human alliance vessel. It was under the command of Captain Anderson. They managed yeah. to save the colony. And the beacon. One of the humans may have used it. Ooh hoo hoo. Are you mad? This human 
must be eliminated. Touchy bitch. I have a feeling like maybe he tried to use it and couldn't. And then my guy somehow was able to use it? I don't know. Doctor. I guess Dr. we'll figure Top out West. what happened. I think he's waking up. Hey guys. Fun party last night. A little bit hungover. You had us worried there, Shepard. Hey, it's just How alcohol poisoning. It's all good. Minor throbbing. Nothing serious. How long was I out? About 15 hours. Something happened down there with the beacon, I think. Oh, yeah. It's my fault. I must have triggered some kind of security field when I approached it. You had to push me out of the way. You had no way to know what would happen. Don't worry. Actually, we don't even know if that's what set it off. Unfortunately, we'll never get the chance to find out. Yeah, because it's destroyed now. The beacon exploded. A system overload, maybe. The blast knocked you cold. The lieutenant and I carried you back here to the ship. Not a local hospital. Was I hurt? Thanks. I appreciate it. Yeah. Physically, you're fine. But I detected some unusual brain activity. Abnormal, Abnormal beta, beta waves. waves. I also noticed an increase in your rapid eye movement. Signs typically associated with intense dreaming. Uh... I was dreaming. I saw. I'm not sure what. Death, I destruction. Saw. Nothing really Death, clear. Destruction. Nothing's really clear. Hmm. Hmm. I better add this to my report. It may. Oh, Captain Anderson. Hello, Anderson. How's our EXO holding up, Doctor? When all the readings look normal, I'd say the command is going to be fine. Of course, I'm going to be it. fine. Shepard, I'm a fucking commander, speak. bitch. In private. Aye, aye, Captain. I'll be in the mess if you need me. Why is she going to the dumpster? Sounds like that beacon hit you pretty hard. Commander. I'm just kidding. It's a mess hall. Are you sure you're okay? I'm fine. I feel bad about Jenkins. Why is Williams here? Uh, we'll do pissed off about the guest. Intel dropped the ball, sir. We had no idea what we were walking into down there. That's why things went to hell. Of course. Guests haven't been outside the Vale in two centuries, Commander. Nobody, Nobody could have predicted this. Okay, then Jenkins. I don't like soldiers dying under my command. Jenkins wasn't your fault. You did a good job, Shepard. Thank you. Okay, now... You said you needed to see me in private, Captain? I won't lie to you, Shepard. Things look bad. Nihilus is dead. The beacon was destroyed and Geth are invading. The Council's going to want answers. We've got nothing to hide. I did my job to help them. Um, yeah. I didn't do anything wrong, Captain. Hopefully the Council can see that. Hopefully. They're probably I'll just going to be a little sensitive, you bitch. You and your report, You're a damned hero in my books. That's not why I'm here. It's Saren. That other Turian. Yeah, the Saren's traitor. A specter, one of the best. A living legend. But if he's working with the Geth, it means, it means he's gone rogue. Of course. But fucking Geth is against trouble. us. Saren's dangerous, and he hates humans. Aw, oh, damn. Guess I won't be able to add him as friends on Facebook. Why? He thinks we're growing too fast, taking over the galaxy. A lot of aliens think that way. Most of them don't do anything about it. But Saren has allied himself with the Geth. I don't know how, I don't know why. I only know it had something to do with that beacon. Yeah. You were there just before that beacon self-destructed. Did you see anything? Any clue that might tell us what Saren was after? Ah, uh, yeah, we'll tell him about the vision. Just before I lost consciousness, I had some kind of vision. Yeah. A vision? A vision of what? Um... I want to say a warning. I saw synthetics. Geth, maybe. Slaughtering people. Butchering them. We need to report this to the Council, Shepard. What are we going to tell him? I had a bad dream? Exactly. How are we going to word don't it? We know what information was stored in that beacon. Lost Prothean technology? Blueprints for some 
ancient weapon of mass destruction, whatever it was. Saren took it. But I know Saren. I know his reputation is politics. He believes humans are a blight on the galaxy. This attack was an act of war. He has the secrets from the beacon. He has an army of Geth at his command, and he won't stop until he's wiped humanity from the face of the galaxy. He's a little bitch. Not if I can help it. I'll stop him. Uh, I'll stop him. I'll find some way to take him down. It's not that easy. He's a specter. He can go anywhere, do almost anything. That's why we need the council on our side. So let's expose him. We prove Saren's gone rogue and the council will revoke his specter status. I'll contact the ambassador and see if he can get us an audience with the council. He'll want to see us as soon as we reach the Citadel. Okay. We should be getting close. Head up to the bridge and tell Joker to bring us into dock. So we're... I believe that we're going to the Citadel? Yeah, I think so, because we got to report to the council. Well, okay, then we got to, I guess, do as he says. Let's go up to the dock and let him know. Let's go in. Hey, Commander. Ooh, Ashley. I'm glad you're okay, Commander. The crew could use some good news after what happened to Jenkins. He'll be missed. Jenkins was a valuable part of this crew. Mm -hmm. Part of me feels guilty over what happened. If Jenkins was still alive, I might not be here. You earned it. You're a good soldier, Williams. You belong on the Normandy. Thanks, Commander. I appreciate that. Yes, Things were this. pretty rough down there. Are you okay? I've seen friends die before. It comes with being a Marine. But to see my whole unit wiped out. And you never get used to seeing dead civilians. But things would have been a lot worse if you hadn't shown up. We couldn't have done it without you, Williams. Thanks, Commander. I have to admit, I was a little worried about being assigned to the Normandy. It's nice when someone makes you feel welcome. I think you're gonna fit in here hmm. just fine, Williams. Thanks, Commander. Awesome. Paragon. Plus two. Awesome. Well, I'm glad I can make you feel welcome. Don't want you to feel nervous. If you decide you like it here, you can stay. If you don't, then I don't give a fuck. Walk. Preferably while we're in space so you know your head explodes and we get a show, but... It's all good. Let's talk to Joker. Yo, what is happening, Joker, my man? Good timing, Commander. I was just about to bring us into the Citadel. Good job. See that taxpayer money at work. Sure. Pay taxes for a reason, am I right? That would be interesting to think about. Like, when we develop space travel, paying taxes for these fucking, um... Space travel warp stuff. And the Citadel. That looks pretty badass. Look at the size of that ship. The Ascension, flagship of the Citadel fleet. Well, size isn't everything. <laughs> Why so touchy, Joker? I'm just saying you need firepower too. Well, Look yeah. at that monster. Its main gun could rip through the barriers in any ship in the Alliance fleet. Good thing it's on our side then. <laughs> Citadel Control, this is SSV Normandy, requesting permission to land. Stand by for clearance, Normandy. Clearance granted. You may begin your approach. Transferring you to an Alliance operator. Roger, Alliance Tower. Normandy out. All right, we Normandy, are docking. This is Alliance Tower. Please proceed to dock 422. And bam, smooth as butter. Hello everybody, welcome. This is the Normandy. We came in here to party and have a good time. And have the audio cut out, like, really bad. This is an outrage! The Council would step in if the Geth attacked a Turian colony? The Turians don't found colonies on the borders of the Terminus systems, Ambassador. Humanity was well aware of the risks when you went into the Traverse. What about Saren? You can't just ignore a rogue specter. I demand action. You don't get to make demands of the council, Ambassador. 
Citadel Security is investigating your charges against Saren. We will discuss the CSEC findings at the hearing, not before. Captain Anderson, I see you brought half your crew with you. Hm. Just the ground team from Eden Prime, in case you had any questions. I have the mission reports. I assume they're accurate? They are. Sounds like you convinced the Council to give us an audience. They were not happy about it. Of course. Seren's their top agent. They don't like him being accused of treason. I'm not gonna sit on my ass just because the Council doesn't want to do anything. If they won't stop Saren, I will. Settle down, Commander. You've already done more than enough to jeopardize your candidacy for the Spectres. The mission on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. Instead, Nihilus ended up dead and the beacon was destroyed. That's Saren's fault, not his. Then we better hope the CSEC investigation turns up evidence to support our accusations. Otherwise, the Council might use this as an excuse to keep you out of the Spectres. They probably will, knowing me, how edgy they are. Go over a few things before the hearing. That's fucking stupid. Shepard, you and the others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you have clearance to get in. Awesome. That's why I hate politicians. <laughs> oh, so true. You see decryption. Follow the pulsing arrow on the radar from Map Citadel. Okay. I'm gonna do this. Screw it. Boom. Okay, Alliance Patrol report. Oh, let's follow the arrow then. And that's not the right area. Do 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 do. Just gonna sit here and put along. A do 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 do. Walking over here to to sit to down. Gotta go down through. Okay. Going through here. And there's a girl we could talk to here. Welcome to the Presidium. Allow me to be your guide. Screw it. Greetings and welcome to the Presidium. My name is Avina, and I am pleased to be your virtual guide throughout this level of the Citadel Space Station. Virtual guide. What does that mean? I am a fully interactive virtual intelligence. Program to provide spontaneous guidance at predetermined locations of interest throughout this level of the Citadel. Okay. I may also be contacted through any of the Presidium VI terminals, should you require assistance. Okay. I'll pass. I I'll... apologize if you found my service unsatisfactory. Please submit Please any submit complaints in writing to the Citadel to the Citadel Tourist and Visitor Board. Have a nice day. The Citadel Rapid Transport. Citadel Tower. Yeah, let's go there. Let's go! You have arrived at the Citadel Tower. Did I go to the right spot, though? Transition. Okay, yes. Yeah, so I think I'm supposed to come up here. Saren's hiding something. Give me more time. Stall them. Stall the council. Don't be ridiculous. Your investigation is over, Garrus. Hi, Garrus. Commander Shepard, Garrus Vicarian. I was the officer in charge of the CSEC investigation into Saren. Come across anything I should know about? Saren's a Spectre. Most uh -huh. of his activities are classified. Yeah. I couldn't find anything solid. But I know he's up to something. Like you humans say, I feel it in my gut. I think the Council's ready for us, Commander. Good luck, Shepard. Maybe they'll listen to you. You don't want to keep the council waiting. Damn you. I want to talk to Garrus. I want to let you know that Saren is a fucking traitor piece of shit. Then I can have that race on my side. Prometheans, I believe it is. Okay. Hello, sir. Don't be ridiculous. The Volus won't be joining the council for years. Okay, so the council's up here, I believe. No, that's a rapid transport. Okay. All right. The hearing's already started. Come on. It's already started. You're fucking late, then, man. The Geth attack is a matter of some concern, 
but there is nothing to indicate Saren was involved in any way. The investigation by Citadel Security turned up no evidence to support your charge of treason. An eyewitness saw him kill Nihilus in cold blood. We've read the Eden Prime reports, Ambassador. The testimony of one traumatized dock worker is hardly compelling proof. I resent these accusations. Nihilus was a fellow Spectre, and a friend. That just let you catch him off guard. Captain Anderson, you always seem to be involved when humanity makes false charges against me. And this must be your protege, Commander Shepard. The one who let the beacon get destroyed. How did you get involved? That was you, not me. The mission to Eden Prime was top secret. The only way you could know about the beacon was if you were there. With Nihilus gone, his files passed on to me. I read the Eden Prime report. I was unimpressed. But what can you expect from a human? Saren despises humanity. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Your species needs to learn its place, Shepard. You're not ready to join the Council. You're not even ready to join the Spectres. He has no right to say that! That's not his decision! Shepard's admission into the Spectres is not the purpose of this meeting. This of meeting has no purpose. The humans are wasting your time, Counselor. And mine. You can't hide behind the Council forever. There is still one outstanding issue. Commander Shepard's vision. It may have been triggered by the Beacon. Are we allowing dreams into evidence now? How can I defend my innocence against this kind of testimony? I agree. Our judgment must be based on facts and evidence, not wild imaginings and reckless speculation. I mean, that makes sense, but still sort of fucked up. Add, Commander Shepard? You won't see the truth, no. You had that guy there. What happened You've to him? You've made your decision. I won't waste my breath. The Council has found no evidence of any connection between Saren and the Geth. Ambassador, your petition to have him disbarred from the Spectres is denied. I'm glad to see justice was served. What about that this witness? Why didn't they just pull the witness? I mean... He could have been... ...for our testimony. He literally just witnessed him fucking doing it. It was a mistake bringing you into the <clears throat> hearing, Captain. You and Saren have too much history. It made the Council question our motives. I know Saren. He's working with the Geth for one reason. To exterminate the entire human race. Every colony we have is at risk. Every world we control is in danger. Even Earth isn't safe. Tell me about this history between you and Saren. Yeah. I worked with him on a mission a long time ago. Things went bad. Real bad. We shouldn't talk about this here. But I know what he's like. And he has to be stopped. Now, of course the Council won't help us. We need to deal with Saren ourselves. As a Spectre, he's virtually untouchable. We need to find some way to expose him. What about Garrus, that CSEC investigator? We saw him arguing with the executor. Yeah. That's right. He was asking for more time to finish his report. Seems like he was close to finding something on Saren. Any idea where we could find him? I have a contact in CSEC who can help us track Garrus down. His name is Harkin. Okay. okay. They suspended Harkin last month, drinking on the job. Yeah. I won't waste my time with that loser. Fucking Harkin. I don't want the Council using your past history with Saren as an excuse to ignore anything we turn up. Shepard will handle this. I'll take care of it. I need to take care of some business. Captain, meet me in my office later. He's got a point. Harkin's probably getting drunk at Cora's Den. It's a dingy little club in the lower section of the wards. Maybe there's another way to find evidence against Saren. You should talk to Barla Vaughn over in the financial district. Okay. Rumor has it he's an agent for the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? An information dealer. Buys and sells secrets to the highest bidder. I've heard Balavan's one of the top representatives. He might know something about Saren, but his information won't come cheap. I okay. should go. Good luck, Shepard. 
I'll be over in the ambassador's office if you need anything else. All right, so let's go talk to both of them. I believe I'm going to go talk to the guy in the sh knows the shadow client first. Mainly because he's probably more promising than the other guy. Plus, if I speak to Garrus or whatever, he might actually trigger the next setup. So, Citadel so Shadow Broker. Go see Bar Levon. Mark all entries as viewed. Okay. Head to the bank in the financial district. Can't I? Oh, that one's done. Okay. Now I need to go find one of those fast travel stations. Which is, should be down here. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 that guy's do, do. up to something. Actually, I'm going to have to cut this video here. I had super fun playing this. Go ahead and if you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe, and all that other fun stuff. You know how it goes. In that case, see you guys in the next one. I will be up really shortly. See ya.